My name is Supremo P. Chickens are everywhere. And this is Minecraft Weekly. And welcome to Minecraft Weekly 66. And this is a text pack spotlight. This week's text pack is Junk Jack. It's 32x. So you need the patcher or Optifine. So here we go. And look at this. This is actually really... I really like this texture pack. Usually I don't like glass with anything on it. But this all looks good. So we have custom paintings. Custom ores. Bricks. Oh, it, that's TNT. Pumpkins. Look at all this. Oh, custom UI. Even font custom. Awesome. Let's go and have a look out here. I just really... This reminds me of like sort of like... Super Nintendo graphics, like Earthbound or something like that. It is awesome. And I'm not sure if it's based on Earthbound or something, but... This is actually a really good job. And the UIs are awesome, so... Let's go and have a look at what the natural world looks like with this texture pack. Ah, default to certificates. And the world looks like this. So... It's got a grid feel into it, but it still looks really, really cool. So let's go and have a fly around, see what some buildings look like. Oh, this is awesome stuff. I don't, I don't know if anyone else is going to like this, but you should, because it's awesome and I like it. So this is the Junk Jack text pack. Link will be in the description below. And this is 32x, so you need the patcher, as I said, or Optifine. And this is one of the best texture packs I've ever seen, to be honest. I really like the style. So, yeah. I'll be back next week with a new texture pack spotlight. And join me again in a minute for the skin spotlight. Yeah. And welcome to this week's skin spotlight. This week's skin is Ronald McDonald. Yes. This is pretty awesome, actually. It looks just like Ronald McDonald. Yes. So this is a, well, the Ronald McDonald skin for Minecraft. And the link's in the description below where you can get this skin. So, what more to say? And then join me again next week for a new skin spotlight. So, stay tuned. Coming up next, we have the creation spotlight. And there won't be any Ronald McDonald in it. And this week's creation spotlight is this. It's called the Rykeen Village. And it's pretty much an island village with a lot of structures. And this one is actually pretty cool. So we've got a boat here. We've got this, uh, some docks here. There's even trains, crates, lights, you know. Let's have a quick look inside if we can. Wow. Great interior design. <laughs> a dirt block. Let's have a look. look. Let's have a look around elsewhere. We've even got a crane on the docks here. Some kind of... I don't know. Maybe a lumber mill or something? I don't know. Let's have a, more... We've got more ships around here. And this... Even more cranes. The cranes are pretty cool. So, surrounded by ships. And as we go up, we've got more buildings and stuff. Even got, well, I guess that's smoke. <laughs> Gotta use your imagination a bit. And as we go up more, we have some more buildings and to the main structure up here. Even got shutters on the windows. Let's try and go inside. Can we go inside? Where's the way in? Where's the way in? Answers on postcard. Because I can't find the way in. Aha, we found the way in. Okay. So in here, we don't have any interior. You can't even get in here. Well. This is a mob house. But, all in all, this whole creation is on fire. Wow, that... Well, you missed something there. Well, I didn't do that. <laughs> But this is the Rykeen village and it is pretty awesome. All oh, look at the amount of structures and stuff you got into that small space. It is pretty amazing. So 
With a bit of interior decoration, it could be incredible, but it's still amazing anyway. So this is the Raikin Village, links in the description below, and I'll be back next week with a new creation spotlight. But coming up next, we've got the Minecraft news, yeah! Now it's time for the Switch Minecraft news, yeah! So what's new this week? Well, first of all, emeralds can now be made into emerald blocks, and also emerald ore spawns in clusters of one is pretty rare but it spawns at a higher height now and also that added this creative inventory that was in the snapshot last week on friday they updated it on friday but i can't do anything about friday update because i have to do my recording on thursday to get it out for the friday so that's why i didn't have that in last week's minecraft news so also you got that now we've got this trip wire block and you can connect string all along like this and it, when you activate a tripwire it sends out a redstone current so you see the lights activate and the dispenser will fire also they've changed enchanting you only need level 30 now to get maximum enchants so let's put this sword in here you can see nothing goes above, above level 30 you only need 15 bookcases now instead of what was needed before so let's get that we only get sharpness free which it's pretty new because I like having like multiple enchants but that's how it is now also certificate trading has been changed a little bit you can see here you can have two inputs now so if you give him an iron chest plate and three emeralds you get an iron chest plate with protection two on it so there's that so we covered that and there's also a new structure found in jungles and it's this jungleish fortress thing. I haven't really explored it because I wanted to do it on the vid. What's going on down here? So this has got tripwires in it now. I get shoot shot by that. So what have we got in the chest? We get emeralds, golds. All that kind of good stuff. That zombie is in the way. What does these do? What? I don't know what that just did. I'm sure I can find out though. I'm... Wow, another chest with bones in. Okay. Is there anything else we're missing? Is there anything underneath it? doesn't look like there is, so that looks like all there is. Yep, pretty much. So, no hidden things under there by the looks of it. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this week's Minecraft news. I may have left one or two things out, like bug fixes and there's kind of little minor changes, but major stuff is all here. So... Yeah, join me again next week for some more Minecraft news. Coming up next, we have the Seed Spotlight, so stay tuned. And welcome to this week's Seed Spotlight. This week's Seed is 87008293409598431330. Yeah, that would be in the description, because I'm not saying that again. So basically you spawn in a plains biome, and what's so great about this seed... Well, first of all, you've got this hole that goes down, well, pretty deep. But, the best thing is this. Whoa! It's like a meteorite has just hit the land and just gone straight through. It's even got lava at the bottom. Look at all this. This is pretty sweet. You, you go straight down to lava level. You can see the top from lava level. And it's kind of crazy. So, the seed will be in the description. And that is it for this week's show. So, some interesting new stuff in the stamp shop. We got, well, this cool seed here. New skin, new texture pack. And, of course, we had a creation. So, join me again next week for all that stuff and maybe more. So, yeah, that's it. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. And join me again next week for Minecraft Weekly 67. So thanks for watching, goodbye.